Hi, my name is Pilar Ibáñez and I'm the author of the book In Rain Fire. In this program, you're going to learn some advice on how to have a happy life. Today, we're going to learn how to charge yourself with energy. For this, the first thing that you need to know is that we are human beings and we are energy. Also, you need to know that we have chakras. Chakras are a concentrated points of energy that we have in our body. There are seven of them. Each chakra has a different color because of their vibration that they have. The first chakra, its color is red. This chakra is, related, is, lo is located in the lower part of the spinal cord and is related to everything that has to do with survival, stability, acceptance, sometimes fear and sometimes safety. It is very important if you are having some troubles with fear that you work with this chakra, with the color red. The second chakra is located in our lower part of the abdomen or where the reproductive system is. Its color is orange. This chakra is related to emotions, finance, creativity, also with projects and how to create them and make them fulfill. If you're having any troubles in one of your projects, you need to work with this color. This will help you a lot because our reproductive system does produce children, but also produce projects. So use this chakra to work on it. The third chakra, its color is yellow and it's located where our digestive system is. It's in the lower part of our di diaphragm. This chakra is associated with power, self-esteem, energy, and also desire and responsibility. If you sometimes are having trouble in your digestive system, it's because you need to work on this color and this chakra. This will help you with your self-esteem. Then we have the fourth chakra, that its color is green, and it's the chakra of the heart, and it's located in our chest. This chakra is also associated to unconditional love, forgiveness, relationships, and intimacy. It's very important if you're having trouble with your, with, your love, with your loved ones or people that are related to you that you work in the chakra of unconditional love. Afterwards, we have our fifth chakra, that its color is blue and it's located in our throat. This chakra is related with communication, expression, discipline, and how you speak to others and to yourself. So if, some, if you have uh, problems in your throat, it's very important to identify what are you telling to others and what are you telling to yourself. So work on this chakra if you have throat ache or something. Afterwards, we have our sixth chakra that is located here where the third eye is. Its color is indigo. This chakra is associated with intuition, imagination, and see the ability to, to see through others and speaking the truth, also with intellectual matters. If you're having trouble with intellectual matters or to see the truth up with the other people and with yourself, work on this chakra. This will help you a lot. At the end, we have the final chakra and the seventh one that its color is white and it's located in the upper part of our skull, in the crown one. It's where you connect with the universe. This chakra is related to searching your spiritual being or what is the meaning to your life. And it also help us connect with the purpose that we have here on earth. So after you know what the chakras is, it's very important that, to know that you have two ways to charge yourself. The first way is to use these colors when you are meditating. So if you used to meditate, put the color in your eyes when you are meditating and this will help you to improve the part of your body and the thing that you want to improve. So if you're having problems with fear, use the red, with your project, use the orange. With the, your emotions, use the yellow. 
with the relationship with others, use the green. While you are speaking or your throat, use blue. What your intuition is or your intellectual matter, use the indigo one. And the thing on the purpose that you have in life, use the white one. Also, there is another technique to charge yourself with energy. As you know, we are made up out of 80% of water. So you can use water to charge yourself. How you do it? It's very simple. You need to first have a piece of paper and also you need to have a pen. What you do is you put a word that you need to work on, that is love, for example. You put it in a piece of paper and you put it in the desk. And then use a glass and put some water on it. Put on the top of the word the water, the glass water, and you wait for two minutes. Then afterwards, you're going to drink that water. This technique to charge, charge the water with energy is a technique that is used by a doctor that is called Masaru Emoto. He has studied all the different particles of the water and how water can affect us because we are made out of water. So if you want to charge yourself, use the different colors, work on them when you are meditating or put them in the spotlight that you have in your house. Use the color to improve yourself and to charge yourself with energy and also use the water to charge yourself. All these techniques will help you to be happy, to take down the cortisol hormone, that's the hormone of the stress, take, down, take up all the hormones that are happy ones like serotonin and also dopamine and you will be much more happier. I hope all this information will help you to judge yourself with, to be with a lot of energy Remember that you can follow us in our social media to have more information about it. Remember that everything starts when you ask. We will see each other in the next time. Bye.